The vision for Donham is this quest to make the highest quality wine possible and to work in harmony with nature to capture the energy, the vibrancy, and the health that we find in the soils to create these beautiful expressions that are site specific. Over the years at Donham, we've just been really trying to push ourselves to the next level every vintage. We got to a point where we felt like we'd taken the winemaking as far as it could go. We decided that the regenerative organic program was something that could really take us to that next level. Donham has four estate vineyards. We have the Bodega property, which has been organic since its inception. We have our Russian River Vineyard, which was certified organic in June of 2022. And then we have our Home Ranch and Carneros, which were certified organic in July of 2022. The key to regenerative farming is really flipping your thinking from trying to extract from the land to trying to work with it. We're really trying to put more back into the soil each year than we're taking out. Some of the core principles for us here at Donham are trying to minimize soil disturbance. We try to maximize our crop diversity and we try to incorporate livestock into the farming system. We brew and apply our own compost tea that's actually made here locally in Sonoma County. We reduce or eliminate tillage in areas that isn't necessary. To maximize crop diversity, we plant cover crop blends. To integrate livestock, we mainly do that by bringing in sheep to graze the whole property. That helps us lessen our tractor passes, saving and reducing our carbon emissions, but we're also reducing our soil compaction. We also have an on-site compost program that we use for our fertilization needs. So we bring manure from an organic dairy, and then we mix that with canes from our winter pruning and the mark from the fermentations. This allows us to really put back a lot of the nutrients that the vines are taking up each year. And then we also have the sheep coming through in the winter, which provide an additional round of fertilization. We are conserving a lot more water. We're emitting less carbon, and we're also storing more carbon in our soils. We're seeing frost in the spring, which we have typically never had here in Carneros. We're seeing more and higher heat waves. We're seeing higher pest pressures in certain parts of Sonoma County. Farming this way, we're allowing the vines to naturally defend and protect themselves against these extreme conditions. There are a lot of benefits to regenerative farming. We see, for example, that the vines are more resistant to disease. We see that they need less irrigation water. Uh, and then we get fruit that's more concentrated, has more complexity of flavor. And we also find that we're able to ferment more naturally because the fruit is healthier when it comes into the winery. What all that contributes to is, is this real sense of energy in the finished wines. And that's really what I'm looking for when I want the wine to be at the highest level, is this, this energy that sort of captures the spirit of the land. We make a lot of different wines. It's really important to me that each one expresses that specific piece of land that it comes from. So to me, that's integrally tied with regenerative farming because in order for the land to have something to say, it really needs to be alive and vital. And so by bringing that life to the soil and really encouraging that, we allow that, that story of the land to be displayed in the wine. The life that thrives here at Donham through the soil, through the plants, through the animals, through the people, that's all connected and transported in our finished wines. I remember coming to Donham the very first time and stopping and realizing in that one special moment that I was really somewhere else. And I think that's what Donham does. It, it really gives you an opportunity and an invitation to stop everything else you're doing and, and be present in this one moment in a place that is alive and thriving.